even though he's throwing a straight punch here, I can still use hoop button number two because I can strike here and come across and strike here. Normally it comes from a back fist here where I strike and hit. Okay, so normally he may throw a punch, miss me, and bring that back. I stop it here, strike, and then I hit. We're just going to bring it straight off that same straight punch. Boom, right here. All right, just right in there just like that. Once I hit this, I don't care if this hand pulls back because he's not going to be able to stop this motion. I'm going to roll that tricep and lock in that arm bar. So we're right back to where we were a minute ago. If you remember who by number one, I was on the inside with the strike. And who by number two, I'm on the outside with the hammer fist strike. Now I roll that in, I'm good to go. Knee trap here, arm bar. Elbow on elbow, on, on elbow. So here, strike, here, all right? Now you does that again, I come in, boom, I hit, I, I rotate a little bit more, and now I have it once again on my belly. From my waist or my belly, boom, I, if he starts to raise up, it's okay, let him. Simple break here, simple break here, bring the cross break here. Bring it up through here, grab the back of the head, lock it in. Hop key is up to you. We flow for a reason. Okay? We flow for a reason. It's a way of coordinated energy. Allow them to generate the energy and put it in there, and then you just do what you need to do with it. But we have to have an entry point, or we can't get any of those techniques. And it's not going to be from a static position. Once again, I'm Jim Hogwood. This is Chris Edward.